Design a Future City is a free week-long programme for transition year students as a collaboration between Connect, the SFI Research Centre for Future Networks at Trinity College Dublin and Dublin City Council. So it's all about bringing young people into the conversations about challenges in our cities and how technology can be used to support them. So across the week we really try and give students a whole range of different experiences and with hands-on and creative workshops we try and make it as interactive as we can. I love the way we got to design our own like cities and how we made them kind of worse before we could make them better. I love that part. It like taught us how to kind of like foster and like nurture our ideas and like how different people's like knowledge on certain things can like, change our perspective. Yeah and like it gives you tools like you can how to think the right way and like and how to like actually make ideas come to life so that was really interesting as well. Where you learn about accessibility and sustainability and like ways to help your city but it's also like we did fun things so we took water samples to test pollution. We uh, tested water from canals in the Liffey uh, to see how much phosphate and nitrate was in the water. Uh, these minerals can cause algae to grow in the water which can then leak out into you know more rural areas. And So at the end of the week, they reflect on challenges in a city and then come up with their own idea of how technology can be used to solve those problems. I couldn't get over how brilliant and creative and wonderful and enthusiastic and articulate all of the students in Falfer. You can hear the excitement in the background. They were just fantastic ideas. Our idea was a like, sensory pod to help with overstimulation in neurodivergent people, elderly or pregnant. So our idea is an app called Green Spaces, which would allow people to find all the green areas in their local community. Uh, yeah, so basically it's a um, stick for blind people that like alerts them where they're about to hit before they actually hit it. So basically the scanner will like build out a 3D map and before you bump into stuff it'll make a noise so like, like that, yeah. Our idea, Xable, is an automatic car seat for paraplegic patients where the paraplegic person can easily lift themselves up onto the seat and get in without any of the hassle of needing other people to lift them up and drag them into the car. For Dublin City Council, we're absolutely delighted to work with young people and really understand their views in terms of the challenges that the city faces. It was really interesting to see that issues such as accessibility and green spaces were important for the students this week. I think the opportunity that the students have had over the past week is just superb. They get a chance to meet like-minded individuals, they get to, you know, be creative, to explore. I was absolutely blown away by the student projects. They just took in everything they learned across the week and applied it in such different ways within their projects. I was especially impressed with all of the emphasis on making our cities more accessible and more inclusive. That was something that really touched home for me. We have definitely future pilots, future engineers, city planners in uh, this week, so it's just so impressive. <laughs> it was amazing. I enjoyed it a lot. I could have done another week of this, to be honest. Like it was, it was, it really was such an experience. Thank you.